Good morning, Facebook. Um, it's your boy Chance, aka Shadow Blade, or Demon King Virus, or Virus from Virus Beats, whichever you prefer, it don't matter to me, but uh there is something that I do want to talk to you guys about. And that is is something very very serious to me. Um, it's something I've been thinking about for the last, you know, about the last week since, you know, I started working on that movie with Rachel, and this is just like I haven't made a, you know, an official decision yet, but it's something that I'm seriously considering. Um, which is a very possible retirement from music. And you guys are probably thinking like, well, no, like we don't want you, queen. we don't want you, well, just hear me out for a minute. There's a reason that I'm saying it. So let me just finish inviting people and I'll explain why. Now. The reason why I'm considering retiring from music is it's not just the fact that I've been doing it for almost eight plus years. It's also due to the fact that I'm not making any kind of money. I know what you guys are thinking. Well, I need to, you know, keep on doing it to make money. That's not true. I've been doing this for eight plus years. And, like, I'm not getting anywhere with it financially. Like, I need to be thinking about my future financially, and it's it's not getting me anywhere at all. And to be honest with you, every time I try to sell a beat, no artist trusts me enough money first before I send them their beat. Like, every artist that wants to buy from me, they don't trust me. They always want me to send them the product before I get my money like that. You send me my money, then I send you the product. And no artist is willing to do that. And it's like, for me, there's no money in it anymore. There's really not. Like, money doing it, then what's the point in doing something that I'm not making a living at? Like, I know I need to work. I would do it. I released... Not only a song, but a freaking album. And I got another song on the way. Which probably isn't going to get released because Amuse is being a dick about her. So, like... Why... Like, make me any money? Something that I've done for eight plus years that... It's, it's getting old. It's getting tiring. Like, waking up and doing the same thing over and over and over again, that's not getting me anywhere. You know? Like, I mean, I've been doing music for years now, and it's it's not getting me anywhere. Like, no artist wants to buy any of my tracks because of the way I sell. And nobody's hiring for album artwork or any kind of artwork, so that's out of the question. So, I mean, what else is there for me to do? Like, I've promoted and promoted and pushed and pushed and pushed and pushed till I'm blue in the fucking face. But nobody buys any of my shit. Nobody. Like, and, and it's ridiculous. Like, it's getting old. Like, I'm tired of putting out music when nobody's going to fucking listen to it or buy it.
Like, I'm tired of doing that same cycle over and over and over and over. I'm tired of that. Like... You know, it's something I've seriously been thinking about. Like I said, I have not made a final decision yet, but I'm seriously considering it, like I said. And it's because of the fact that not only, like I said, not only do artists hate the way I sell my beats and don't trust me enough to you know, send me the money before I send them the product, but I've just been doing this shit for years, and honestly, it's wearing me down physically and, you know, mentally, it's wearing me down. Like, I've been doing shows on Facebook Live for multiple, multiple, multiple years, and you know, granted, I enjoy doing those. I really do. But right now, like, you know, I feel like I'm at that point in my life where, you know, I need to move on and do something else for a while. And then maybe later on, come back to that. Like, you know, with the release of that movie that I'm working on for this whole entire year. I've got that I'm working on. So it's like, what else can I do? If nobody wants to help me out by buying some of my instrumentals for 10, 20 bucks, And nobody buys any of my music or even bothers to listen to it hardly. Then, and the fact that I can't do fucking shows around here because people don't have their shit right, like, what else is there for me to do? Like, what else can I do except to put my music on the back burner for now and move on? But, like, like I said, you know, I have not made any final decisions yet. I have not said that I'm going to retire. I have not said that I haven't, but I'm considering. That doesn't mean I'm going to, and that doesn't mean I haven't retired yet. That doesn't mean I'm going to retire. But that's just something that I'm thinking about. But, if I do retire, you guys guys are being left in good hands. You guys are being left in the hands of my little brother Ian and, you know, the entire team of Bloodshot Records. Like, you guys will be left in very good hands if I, if it does come to that. Like, if I do decide to retire from music, and stuff, you guys will be left in very good hands, not only with, you know, my little brother Ian, but you'll also be left in the hands of Aiden and everybody from Bloodshot Records. Because Ian is my protege. He's the guy that I want to take over my place when, you know, if and when I do retire. And at this point, I am seriously considering it because I'm not making any money off of it. I keep on getting fucked over by people. I've been burned way too many times by people. And like I said, no artist trusts me enough to send money to my PayPal and then me send them the product. They always want me to send them the beat and then them pay me. Sorry, it doesn't work like that. You send me the money, and then I send you the product via email. You send the money to my PayPal, then I send you the product. 
but no artist wants to do that. And no artist wants to hire on an album cover artist because they're always wanting to do that shit themselves. So really, what's the point if there's no financial gain in doing it? And hey, what's up, April? But I mean, you know, like I said, I do have that movie that I'm working on with major, you know, U.S. and Philippines actress, Princess Rachel Hadassah. I'm working on that film called Lady in White with her. I filmed my scene this last week, sent it to her. Um, I do have the unofficial trailer up with my scene that I shot. So, I mean, I am working on that. And who knows? Like, maybe me doing music. I mean, maybe it's something else. But right now, I really feel like there's no financial gain for me within the music industry. Because like I said, I've released an album on to, you know, the internet. I've released my work on the Spotify, iTunes, Google Play, you name it. I've uploaded my work onto there. One, like one or two people out of almost a thousand different people on my friends list had bought the album. But that's it. But other than that, what financial gain is there for me? Like, I have no financial gain in music right now. None. And unless I can get paid to do fucking cover songs and shit by guitar or do metal style vocal covers of songs, there's nothing left for me. There's no financial gain for me. So, you know, it it is what it is. I mean, I know that I'm a huge part of what goes on with, you know, the Bloodshot Records record label and a huge part of your guys' lives music-wise over the years. And I'm glad that I could be part of that. But right now, like, I really need to start thinking about my future. Like... You know, I need to start investing my time and energy into something that I know can actually get me a very real career. Like, I can't keep doing the same thing over and over and over and over, day in and day out, or and expecting different results. I can't do that. That's not me. I can't just keep doing the same thing, knowing I'm not getting anywhere, and then expect, you know, different results because the results aren't changing. It's the same, always. So, I'm sorry, guys, but as of right now, I am seriously considering it. As I said, I have not made a final decision yet. But whatever decision I do decide, I do hope that you guys will stand behind me on 100%. I really do hope that you guys will stand behind me 100% on the decision. So with that being said, guys, I am going to hop off here and sit down and, you know, think about it some more. So, I will let you guys know what I decide either by the end of the day or within the next couple days.